if you're a fan of the George Thurgood and the Destroyers. We've covered various Bo Diddley songs over the years. And uh, pretty popular beat. Thought we might go over a little bit of how that developed, how it's progressed over the years. Study Bo Diddley intensely uh, before we started the band, and we studied we studied it pretty good. Uh, Clifton James is the man responsible and uh, drummer extraordinaire. He's the one that gave Bo Diddley that beat, so they say. So he starts off and, and, and it, it does a. He does a, a if you if you listen to it he does a few different things but it's sort of like a, stuff like that. We uh, covered um, Ride on Josephine on our first record and that's just kind of like a I just I did this just a little bit differently like. basic configuration there. Who Do You Love, which we still do in our lives, so probably the most popular Bo Diddley piece we do. But and we did it with this with the with the beat like that where it's um, different from Bo Diddley's version. It's a straight it's a straight beat. It's it, they play it, we play it, but we just wanted to do it that way. And I started out just Just like that, pretty basic, straight ahead. And uh, over the years, I developed, just kind of developed different ways of doing it, because things evolve as you've been playing over 40 years. <laughs> so uh, we went to, we did it like a. And now um, I do it almost completely different. It's just a little more jazzy kind of. The way I'm doing it now, it, it's uh, I added some percussion to it, where I'm side sticking on on certain beats, and it just uh, no really pattern set. It's just playing along with what you know what, he, what George is singing and, and, and what the guys are playing. And then we, you know, I talked to a guy that heard me play something one day, it hurt, like, like this, and he goes, you play that Bo Diddy, it sounds like a Harley, uh, it sounds like a Harley idling. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so. Does that sound like a Harley idling to you? I used the fat part of the sticks, more of a mallet kind of effect. Um, and it just always felt right to me to do that, so that's why I do that. <laughs> 